Welcome guys, in this tutorial, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create pins in the vet. If you are watching my video for the first time, please subscribe the channel to get more tutorial like this. Uh, first, I'm going to open the family. From here, I'm going to open new. And then from here, so let's change to the small. And from here, I'm going to open a generic one generic model and then open okay and uh, first I'm going to change my unit type you in and then from here I'm going to change my unit to millimeter okay and okay okay and now I'm going to select extrusion and now let's select to uh, the pick line and then I'm going to offset one millimeter uh, let's line one here one from here and then again let's uh, offset one meter okay this side okay and now I'm going to trim and extend let's trim and extend trim and extend also I'm going to trim and extend this side as well okay and then let's finish let's uh, finish Let's see in 3D. Let's look like this. Okay. So this extrusion start from 00, zero into uh, 250. So I'm going to select the high of it, uh, the fence. So let's make one 800. Okay. Now I'm going to uh, change uh, the the material. So let's see in realistic. It's like this, and from here again click the fence, and then from here I'm going to change the material. So let's create a new material. And let's rename this. Fence and check this box and copy and make this. So let's then make very find something fence. Uh, Tangling fence. I'm going to select this one. Okay, then let's close. Apply and okay not come so let's select this fence okay here I go this now we created a uh, power face so now I'm going to uh, create one profile in here and one in here so uh, let's first uh, create one profile in here so let's go to the level floor and in here again I'm going to create one extrusion okay from here I'm going to select the circle and then I'm going to create a profile uh, five uh, to find to find five okay and this extrusion start from let's start from minus 10 centimeter to the high of this I'm going to select 2 meter then okay and finish 
So let's see in 3D. Okay, the goddess looks like this. So if you look closer, it's uh, look like this. Okay, and now I need to uh, create one uh, profile in here and one in the in here. So for this, I'm going to use a sweep. So let's go to sweep, select the sweep, and then I'm going to use the cut. And I'm going to select this line, and then so let's go to this solution and then finish and now let's edit profile and now in here again I'm going to create uh, one profile like this so let's select the circle and then I'm going to create in here because I'm going to make a fix okay and now this from here to bring the from here okay and now let's finish then finish okay let's see and Let's look like this. So for for this, let's us again copy this. And let's go to in this solution. Uh, let's copy from here to. And now uh, let's open one new family from here go to the file again new and then family and from here again uh, I'm going to select generic model as line based so let's find that and this one generic model line based and then let's open and then let's go to the family one and i'm going to select this and load to the uh, new family and let's uh, put in here okay so let's align this one uh, select this one and this then open the list so let's align this as well then lock okay so let's change the unit as well again and type your n and then let's select millimeter okay and okay this uh smaller than this so let's click this one and let's extend this a little bit okay and now let's uh, array this select this one and then go to array and I'm going to select the last one and then let's from here and select to here, okay. And again, let's align this one as well and then lock and place, okay. So now let's see how much is this the length of uh, this, it should be two meter yeah this is two meter okay 
okay and now let's get some parameter for this and that's from here I select add parameter and then I'm going to uh, give name uh, friends and then instead and then okay so let's and now let's uh, create one more parameter so let's select this and then from here new parameter and then uh, let's name v and then instance then okay as you know this uh, the length of the our fence was two uh, two meter so i'm going to get name two thousand and then uh, let's create uh, one formula for this then divided by b okay and then apply and okay uh, so let's see it's uh, working working or not as you can see now it's working and now let's uh, load to the project uh, before that uh, let's uh, open the project so from here i'm going to open one new project and uh, i'm going to select architecture template and okay so before i load the fence uh, i'm going to create a floor in here so let's a rectangle floor maybe like this so let's change the unit i'm going to use again millimeter in here as well okay and then let's uh, finish okay so let's uh, select this and let's go to edit i'm going to change the material as well duplicate and then I'm going to change the thickness to 2 millimeter so let's uh, I'm going to make like a site so let's create a new material from here let's uh, rename and then press so let's take this box copy and from here let's go to library inside the library uh, site work so let's see in here uh, grace grace with high quality i'm going to select this one then let's close this apply okay okay So let's see in 3D. Uh, it looks like okay. Let's look like this. So let's go again to the level. It uh, looks like this. Again, now I'm going to back to the family file. So now let's uh, load to the project, and from here check this box, and then. So now I'm going to create draw in here the fence. So let's start from here. Uh, to in here. Like align this, okay? And then let's go to 3D. Here we go. This is how to create fence and rivet. Now you can see now very well. Okay, this is how to create fence and rivet. If you like a tutorial like this, please subscribe the channel to get more tutorial like this.
Thanks for watching.